Here is an example of an equation y equals mx plus b. Now this is an equation of a straight line. The constants in this equation are m and b. So m and b are numbers, they're fixed, so they're called constants. The variable variables in this equation are x comma y x and y are two variables so this is an equation the reason why we call it an equation is because it has two sides one on the left side of the equal to sign and one on the right so that's an equation if you see an equal to the left side equal to the right side that's an equation the exponent on the variable x so here when we look at x x is the same as x to the 1. So the exponent is 1. Same thing with y. y is the same as y to the 1. So the exponent on the variable y is 1. So this is called a linear equation in two variables. The word linear comes from the fact that the exponent on x is 1 and the exponent on y is 1. If this is the case, then it's called a linear equation in x and y. So we have two variables, x and y, and, in, and when you look at x and y in the equation, you'll see x, which is the same as x to the 1, y, which is the same as y to the 1. Now we look at uh, a linear equation in one variable. So the equation contains, so if it's an equation in one variable, then the equation must contain one variable. It can be called x or y, it's just one or the other. You can call it anything you want, but there has to be just one of these and the exponent has to be 1 for it to be called a linear equation. So the, the word linear comes when the exponent on the variable is 1. So this is an example of a linear equation. 2, 3, and 5 are constants. x is the variable. The exponent on the variable is 1. So the number of variables in the equation is 1. The exponent on the variable is 1. So our variable is x. In the equation, you see an x to the 1. So therefore, um, it is a linear equation in one variable. So the equation 2x plus 3 equals 5 is a linear equation in one variable. Let's look at this equation. 5x squared plus 2 equals 7.03. So 2 is a number, 7.03 is a number, 5 is a number. Each one of those is called a constant. There's only one variable, and the variable here is x. So that's the only variable that we see. The exponent on the variable, do you notice that it is x squared? So the equation is not a linear equation. It would be a linear equation only if the exponent were a1. So it's not a linear equation. It is called a quadratic equation. Since the exponent is 2, this is called a quadratic equation. Let's check the number of variables here. Is this an equation? Notice that this is not an equation. We do see variables, but it's not an equation. We don't see an equal to sign in it. It is an expression. It's an algebraic expression that can possibly be simplified, but is not an equation. The variables is definitely 1. The exponent on the variable is 1. Everything looks good, but it is not 
an equation at all because we don't see an equal to sign. Now, if I changed that to an equal to, then that would be an equation. So if we have 2x plus 1 minus 5x, then that would be equal to 2x minus 5x plus 1. 2x minus 5x is negative 3x plus 1. So we can simplify the expression, but this is not an equation. So please do not try to solve the equation for x.